Are you a dinosaur yet? Subscribe to become one now. Hello all dinosaurs, so today let's take a look at all our recent new dinosaurs all in a box, so let's begin. This is my latest edition, the Concavenator, okay? Doer attack Concavenator right here. So let's choose a dinosaur to actually fight with it. What about this pretty new Allosaurus? So who's gonna win? What do you guys think? I think the Allosaurus has the upper hand. So I'm just gonna say the Allosaurus will win the first battle, okay? So let's place this aside right over here. And let's take a look at these two really huge gigantic dinosaurs. First, we have our favorite Destroy and Devour Indominus Rex. Of course, check this out. If you press this once more, you can actually see the lights coming out on the neck. Yeah, from the neck I'm in. Yeah, so this is really nice. What about if she versus a huge Ceratosaurus, which is equally huge as her i think this two looks pretty pretty close in terms of size this is the brand new ceratosaurus from pnso and check out the eyes oh my goodness it looks incredible so my question to you guys is ceratosaurus versus the indominus rex who will win if the ceratosaurus is so big I think the Indominus Rex is still going to win. What do you guys think? Let's place this beautiful Indominus Rex right over there. Okay, let's pick up another dinosaur. Okay, this it's okay, not exactly a very new acquisition, but still relatively new. This is the Berserker Rex from Nanmu, which looks like an Indominus Rex. So let's pick a dinosaur for a battle. And that's Pseudoceratops. I think there is no competition. Definitely the Berserker Rex is going to win. So let's place this over here. Okay. Next up, let's take a look at some new dinosaurs. We have a new Velociraptor. Yep, this is new and it's some feathers right here. So let's pick a dinosaur. What about um this? This is known as the Berserker Raptor. So it's basically like an Indoraptor. So Velociraptor versus Indoraptor. I'm just gonna say the Indoraptor will win. Okay, let's pick up more figures. Another new dinosaur from PNSO. The Ankylosaurus, what a beautiful figure. As you can see, it is really nice. But it's kind of kind of obese. This dinosaur, as you can see, is very very bloated. <laughs> okay, so let's pick a dinosaur to battle. Mazarus. Okay, this looks like a juvenile Mazarus. So I'm gonna say the Ankylosaurus will win the battle. What do you guys think? Let me know down below. Okay, next up we have finally we have a dinosaur which can roar. A Rorivar. Pretty cool Rorivar. Ceratosaurus from the Dino Rivers. And let's pick a dinosaur for battle. What about this one right here? What a beautiful figure. This is the Giganotosaurus from PNSO. This is one super detailed and awesome figure if you check this out the ridges right here it's actually like a shiny gloss oh i love this and check out the teeth yeah really nice can actually open and close the jaw it's brilliant this is one brilliant figure all right so ceratosaurus versus the giganotosaurus who's gonna win i think 
the Giganotosaurus will win for sure because you know sometimes it can actually grow larger than a T-Rex and it is definitely way bigger than a Ceratosaurus which means it is most likely way stronger as well. Let's take a look at the next one. We have a, uh, what is this? Uh, Euhinosaurus. Pretty nice. Okay, this is a um, prehistoric sea creature. So let's take a look. Let's find um, what about Euhinosaurus versus a Deicosaurus. I think the Deicosaurus will win. What do you guys think? This Deicosaurus is from PNSO as well. So both prehistoric sea monsters. Next up, we have the jungle. Kilo Jungle T Rex from Rebel, <clears throat> which is a beautiful, beautiful figure. If you take a look at this, golden shiny eyes. So T Rex versus um the Apostles Nightmare, um, which is a white version of the Indoraptor. Who's gonna win? Oh, T Rex versus the Indoraptor. This is going to be a close battle, but I'm gonna pick um. The Indoraptor cars, you know, it is super intelligent, super fast. It could probably just climb all over T Rex and just, you know, inflict plenty of wounds on it. Okay, next up, Amagosaurus. This is a beautiful figure. Amagosaurus with plenty of thorns and spikes on his body. Um, this is a pretty flexible tail. Or I mean, a pretty flexible figure with a nice tail. And um, this Amagosaurus, it's brilliant. This is one brilliant, brilliant dinosaur figure. You heard me. One brilliant, brilliant dinosaur figure. So this versus Stegosaurus, I'm gonna say it's going to be a tough battle, but probably the Amagosaurus will win because it is just way bigger. It has a strong tail, we could just whip out at the Stegosaurus. So I'm gonna choose the Amagosaurus. Okay, what about you guys? Please let me know down below. Okay, next up we have um, a Dracorax. Dracorax, beautiful figure. Dracorax versus... What is this? What is the name of this? Is this Animal Tox? I can't re really remember. So if you guys do remember, let me know these two versus each other. These two figures are from Schleich. I got them recently. So if these two battle... I'm gonna say Animatox cause it has some horns and some defense mechanism like the armor. So I'm gonna pick that. What about you guys? Please let me know. Okay, next up another figure which is a pretty cool figure from Jurassic World. It's the Dino Rivals Savage Strike Dilophosaurus. You can actually squirt water. So you can place water right here by just running it under the running tap and just press it. Oh, you can still see some water left over from the previous time. Yeah, so once you press the belly, you can actually squirt the water out. So the Alophosaurus versus the Diablo Ceratops. Who's gonna win? I think the Diablo Ceratops because it's pretty huge, but you know, she has to be careful of the venom coming out from the Dilophosaurus. Okay, the Diablo Ceratops, this figure, it's from Schleck. Beautiful figure, I love it. So, yes. Let's pick up another one. Okay, what is this? Okay, this is the Young Trinosaurus. Young Trinosaurus. Okay, this figure, it's pretty cool. Young Trinosaurus versus um, Chunkingosaurus. I'm just gonna say the Young Trinosaurus will be after a um, hard fought battle. Yeah, so these two figures are from PNSO. Next up, let's take a look at this. We have a Plesiosaurus, which is a really, really cute little figure from Schleich versus, let's say, okay, we are lacking one figure. Plesiosaurus versus Deicosaurus. I, I still think the Deicosaurus is gonna win because the Plesiosaurus, it has a very tiny jaw which can only uh, be used to fish. So the Deicosaurus definitely has a predatory um, jaw which can just rip off flesh from you know different dinosaurs and prehistoric marine creatures so next up we have a like 
figure. Okay, this is a juvenile Therizinosaurus versus a Spinops, a fully grown Spinops which weighs more than a ton. It's built like a tank. It comes with this frill with plenty of horns, and this dinosaur is just gonna win easily, like super easily. Yep. So these are all the battles in the box. So please let me know down below all the winners from the battles which I mentioned from your point of view. Okay, from me, yeah, it's gonna be a close battle throughout all these many battles. And right now, let's pick some figures that we really like. Our top three most favorite figures. Okay, one of them is definitely the Amagosaurus. It is so cool. I love it. Okay, so this is number three. Um, the other one, I'll me just go with this Giganotosaurus from PNS. So it looks amazing. I love it. Okay, um, next up, let's take a look at the Dilophus. Oh, not this for sure. My most favorite figure from this box is definitely the Indominus Rex. So let me know down below what's your top three most favorite figures. I am Dan and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video but as usual check out a previous video you know on the screen and always make sure you subscribe if you like dinosaurs if you like Jurassic World you make sure you subscribe of course I upload dinosaur videos almost every single day so make sure you subscribe okay and I'll see you guys tomorrow my name is Dan goodbye